Hello, this is Steve True with Excel-Templates.com. Please make sure you sign up for my blog at Excel-Templates.com so that you're sure to get the latest tips and tricks right in your inbox. Also, don't forget to sign up for the YouTube channel as well. I wanted to just show you a real quick trick uh, that you may or may not know in Excel. I had a very experienced user trying to write some VBA code and needed to show an apostrophe before his data string, kind of like you see here. Um, in that I'm showing this formula, but I wanted to, if I want to put an apostrophe before it, or maybe wrap it in single quotes, uh, it's a little difficult to do in Excel unless you just know this real quick and easy trick. You probably already know it, but if you don't, I wanted to show it to you. So, in order to do this, let's go ahead and write equals sum, and we'll do uh, 7, 56, 22, and you'll notice that it actually shows the sum of that number. Uh, now, if I put in a single quote and do equals sum of 7, 56, and 22, hit enter. Notice that it does show my formula of the sum with the parentheses, but uh, I still can't see that single quote. So since he was looking for that single quote, I need to show how to do that one as well. So let's go over here and do it one more time. What you want to do, the trick is just do two single quotes equals sum. Enter your parentheses, 7, 56, 22, hit the enter key. Notice that you now see one single quote still showing up uh, within the spreadsheet. And so the trick is, is the first quote is used to say the rest of this is text. And then after the first quote, as you can see here, so after the first quote, anything after that is what's actually going to show up as text within the format of the cell. So first quote is text. The rest of it's going to show up. This worked for him for his VBA code, and in case you need to do something like, uh, uh, for instance, let's say you needed to type in your sheet name, and you need to wrap, because it has a space, you need to wrap it in single quotes, and then uh, you have maybe your named range. Uh, if you need these single quotes to appear either in VBA or just show up in the spreadsheet itself, just make sure you put in another single quote right in front of it. Worked out for this expert Excel user and uh, would work out for you as well.